guys, I'm back. Sorry to bombard the feed for a moment here, but um, I wanted to now go into detail about the ultimate reset. So a couple people have asked about the ultimate reset, which it talks about it in your guidebook from the three day refresh. But could you see yourself doing something like this for 21 days straight? Um, it is something that I did in the fall and is truly a life changing experience. It is called the ultimate reset. So if you look through your guide booklet for the three day refresh, it will talk about the ultimate reset and it will talk about resetting your body for 21 days. And while that may seem overwhelming at first, it's actually a really cool experience. So I want to tell you a little bit about this. If you think that, you know, you definitely want to do something to maintain, maybe it's not just a maintenance plan. Maybe you want to go through the entire ultimate reset program from start to finish, which is 21 days long. So the ultimate reset reset basically helps you to first reclaim that gut health, then to release all the toxins and get all that stuff out of there, and then to restore your gut. So if you ever have any anything going on with your gut or maybe you want to feel like completely energized in a new way, maybe you wanna get rid of some um, proteins like meats for a little while. Maybe you just want to fast from meats for 21 days. So this is something that I would highly recommend you ask your person who's added you into this group if you're interested in it. All right, so basically, the ultimate reset has three phases, and each week is one phase. So phase one, you're still eating proteins like fish, and you're still eating, um, <clears throat> excuse me, you're still eating some meats and things like that, but you're preparing your body to go into phase two. So in phase one, you gradually remove the things like um, red meat and like dairy from your diet, um, which can which are great sources of protein, but also can wreak havoc on a digestive system. All right, so week two is phase two. So phase two is when you are basically going to release all the toxins from your body, um, release any of the unwanted compounds. Hi, Christina, am I in my right group here? Tell me I'm in my uh, right group here. Um, anyway, that you've been holding on for, for, for a little while. So that is the phase two. That's the second part of this program, which the first part, again, is when you're going to reclaim your gut health. You're going to slowly get rid of your proteins, such as meats and dairy. Phase two, you are going to do somewhat of a cleanse. So you're going to do a detox to your system, which is similar to the one we're doing with the fiber sweep, but even to a little bit greater level. Phase three is the third week, which is when you restore your gut. So week three is when you're gonna restore your gut health. You're going to add in something called Revitalize, which is going to help every aspect of the of gut health in, in efficiently putting back nutrients into your system and just to um, help with digest digestion. You'll have extra digestive enzymes in there and you will have mostly fruits and vegetables for that last week. So that's the three week overview. That's just in a nutshell, phase one, phase two, and phase three. And so that is a three week program and that's the three weeks of the ultimate reset. Basically takes you from start to finish exactly what you should do. So um, it gives you an overview of what's in the box. You have some extra supplements this time. You're gonna have some extra power greens, which is just like this. You're gonna have your extra power greens. This is something that I like to put into my smoothie uh, on a regular basis, but during the three day, or sorry, the ultimate reset, you have this for sure on a consistent basis to get your extra greens in there. You have, um, Okay, you have Revitalize, which is a, a, a di di digestion tool. You have a detox kit. You have a mineralized um, kit, which is gonna add some sodium back into your diet. And then you're gonna have something that's gonna soothe your stomach. So Soothe is going to help you to just soothe the um, fibers and everything in your digestive system. And they're all included in the kit. Okay, so if you wanted to learn more about each of them, it's gonna go into detail here with your, the, your guide booklet. Um, and what happens is basically you go through from start to finish on week one, it tells you exactly what to eat on this one. So this isn't one where you're gonna choose different things. You still get to make decisions on what you'd like to put together. But for the most part, I wanna take you to the recipe section because it gives you specifics on what you're going to do. So in week one, it tells you exactly what you're gonna do here with your supplements, but also it's gonna give you day one. So right here, it's going to say, breakfast, lunch, and dinner options. And look at how good the food looks. So you're not starving yourself. By any means, you are not starving yourself. You are eating real whole foods and each phase of the way is going to be something different. So again, in phase one, you're eating things like fish and dairy. In phase two, you are not eating things like fish and dairy, but you're going to a more vegan um, <clears throat> diet. 
So phase two is again the release pot portion of this. When you're going to add in your power greens, when you're going to add in more of a detox, it's going to give you details here on what to mm -hmm, what to do next. Okay, so phase two starts on day eight, week two, and you can see that you're going to more fruits, you're going to more vegetables, you're going to beans and different legumes. This is actually one of my favorite soup recipes of all time. Um, and then day 13, it takes you through the week two. Okay, week three is the restore phase. So in restore, again, it's gonna tell you exactly what to do with your supplements, and then it's going to take you to day 15. So now you can see you are pretty much eating a vegan diet by this time, which if you've never gone totally vegan for even, even a short period of time, I had never done that. I am a big meat eater and I love dairy, um, but I will tell you that these three weeks were life-changing and something that I would like to do again. So anyway, I just wanted to give you a little bit better idea. You have every recipe back here in the booklet, and these are recipes that I oftentimes go back to even when I'm not doing the reset because they are so delicious. It really takes you out of your comfort zone. If you've never made sushi before, you get to make a vegan sushi um, without fish, but it's a really cool way to just step outside of the comfort zone and do something that you're not usually re uh, used to doing. It's something that's going to take you in a place that maybe you haven't been before with being vegan, with just cleaning out your body, and with doing a program that is start to finish with three weeks. Now, here is the suggestion. If you do decide you want to do the, the ultimate reset, I would highly recommend that you do it in a time that you're home. It is really hard to do this while eating out and by being on, while being on vacation. In fact, I would highly discourage you from doing it in the summertime if you are going to be traveling a lot. If you have a three week period from tomorrow, let's say, or whatever, next week until the end of June, when you know you're gonna be home and you know that it won't be hard for you to eat at home, then I am all for it. I liked doing it in the fall because I did it in October, and from October to um, you know the end of uh, October, I was able to just stay home for the most part on meals, and by that I don't mean that you can't eat at work or if you're on the go, but what I mean by that is that you are preparing your own meals because if you go to a restaurant, it would be really hard to stay on track with this. And if you're going to do it, you should do it 100% all in. So just wanted to give you a sneak peek into the Ultimate Reset. This is another option. In addition to your maintenance guide, this is another option where you could for three weeks completely rearrange your diet to just get back on track, to heal your gut, to um, again, just really change things up with your body. So anyhow, I hope you're having a wonderful, wonderful day when you see this. Good job on day three of the cleanse. I can't wait to see results in the morning and hear about it and just hear how you are feeling overall. Have a wonderful evening and we'll see you again soon. Bye for now.